shots he made to UFC veteran Conor McGregor, you can know that this is something big. Jake Paul made a resounding impression after registering his second win in the professional boxing circuit after knocking out former basketball player Nate Robinson in the second round of his fight and was quite expressive in his post-fight interview. Jake Paul, whose career just took off, is already looking to challenge the titans of UFC Conor McGregor and a member of his camp Dylan Danis. What? The popular YouTuber wants to continue fighting in the four-sided ring and is confident of challenging the top fighters. Jake Paul began his professional boxing career after defeating fellow social media celebrity Anison Gibb in January 2020, and has since developed his image as an up-and-coming professional boxer. But we all know staging wannabe boxing matches to generate likes isn't like the real thing. Call him a dreamer, but Jake is also set on avenging his brother Logan Paul after Logan got beaten by rival KSI. After Jake voiced this out, KSI also admits he would take his chances against Jake Paul as well. Whooping the Paul brothers would seem like a sweet deal to KSI. Nice. His last opponent, however, Nate Robinson, was fighting competitively for the first time after ending a decade-long career in the NBA two years ago. The fight, however, has been under mass scrutiny and intense criticism, with several boxers slamming the decision to allow it to go ahead. Most bigwigs in the boxing industry have voiced out their opinions, including Mike Tyson's former trainer Teddy Atlas, who tweeted, I don't care about athletes or not. Stop allowing guys who don't know how to fight into a ring. Awful.